friends. So what I wanted to do today is to try and see whether I could do a swipe from the consistency of paint that I already have mixed in my bottle. So from what I understand, it's supposed to be thicker consistency. So this is just a test to see whether this would work. If it will not work, then we'll give it a try with some thicker paint, but let's give it a go. So I'm gonna have this cross part bright yellow. It does look a little thin. I'm gonna do the Craft Smart Graphite. And then this one is just a, a gray where I mix the Artist Loft white and black to come up with a lighter gray. And then on top of here, I'm gonna just try the black cell activator, which is my golden heavy body black. So, oh, you know what? I want to try to do that on just the paper that I slide across it. So I'm just going to take this paper and I'm going to put it on the bottom here and try to slide it across. So I, I've seen it done multiple ways, but I want to see how this works first. All right, let's give it a go. And then hopefully it doesn't drop in the paint. So from my understanding, you're not supposed to go all the way down. So let's see what happens. As of right now, that's not doing anything. And it's probably because I have too much paint on there. But I'm going to try it again. And I have nothing to wipe this on. So I am going to put it on my table. This time. And I should have had a napkin. Got one here. It's not the napkin I wanted to use. But at least it's something. Okay. So let me try. Hey. That that I rubbed on the table actually sailed up. So let's try this from the other side. Even though it looks like a lot of my paint is gone because I went up too high. Let me try to go back over this part again. Even though I see cell activation. Let's try it again. I think I put too much paint on there the first time. This comes out a little thick. Let me try to go in the middle. Yeah, it just seems like a lot of wasteful paint. That's the only thing about the swipe technique. So I have a little piece. I'm just going to try to do it on the, well, let me see. Try to do it on the side. Too much black. I think it's too much paint. So I do agree that the paint needs to be thicker because this is just giving me bunches of cells and it's not uh, formatting the way it should be formatting. It is sales, but it's not the way it should be. And I didn't go all the way up in the middle like I should have, but I did get some... Um, Cell activation. What I do see there, there is some cell activation. So let's pause this and let's try to go back with 
thicker paint. Let's give it a try. Okay, so I mixed up the paint, made them thicker. Don't know if this is going to work. Keep your fingers crossed because I just mixed them up. Um, and the one that I mixed up before that I made just out of white and black from our artist loft, it looks like it's a little darker, but I just mixed them up very quickly. So also my yellow is not the same color. Yellow is the only one I can find. So let's just give it a go. Let's see because this, this is very thick. The ones that I have mixed in my bottle already are mixed to the consistency of the Dutch pour, so. Just an experiment, so. Worst that could happen, it just doesn't work. This time, though, I'm just going to put the, the black cell activator directly on top. Even though I feel like it's thick, but the rest of it is thick, so... I'm trying to have such a heavy hand. All right, let's go from this way first. Let me let this back out. Okay. That I didn't do right. What can I say? This is my first go at a swipe. So I guess I'm doing pretty good. Keep paper towels handy, guys. If you're going to do a swipe, definitely keep paper towels handy. Okay. Okay, and then I'm just going to try to pull from the other way. Let's see. I don't think I came down hard enough on that one in the middle. What I'm going to do is just come down. Let's see. I better do another line. Nope. I'm going to just give it a go. I don't know if anything's going to come up or not. See some little spots. Up, oh, and I went too deep. See that? I went too deep. I'm trying to find some little pieces that doesn't have paint on it. I think it's still too much paint left on it because you're supposed to see the other colors up under it. Yeah, I think it's a little bit too much paint on there.
Okay, let's try this thing one more time. I'm going to give it another go. I'm not going to put the whole thing on there. I'm going to just see what happens if we have a little bit of white. Looks like we don't have enough white. Ah, I wanted to give it another try. Probably because I put too much white on there the first time. So just for trying purposes, experimenting, even though I know that's not enough white. I'm going to try to do it a little thinner because I kept going back over that one. And the thinner it got, the more the cells came out. So let's see what happens. Even though I don't have enough paint. Or swiping. I my swiping tools. Ah, just a moment, guys. I have to get some more swiping tools. Okay, I couldn't find my swiping, my little piece of paper I use, uh, I, I collected to swipe with. So what I'm going to do is use this little scraper from Loli Effie that came with my mat. So let's give that a try. See a little bubble here. Okay. And I was wrong about my new phone, you guys. I actually had to go back to this one because I ran out of memory on the other one. So I, instead of me going to the computer, trying to get that off of there, I said, I'm going to try this phone again and see what work, um, what happens. And I gave it another try. And the video looks good. I hope it's good on the other end. Okay, so let's give this another try. I wish this would come out there. But I kind of need to go from both ends anyway. Let's see. So at least I can clean this back off and level it better. Okay. So I don't have much practice with swiping. So I guess this will be a learning lesson for me and I need to give it some practice so that I can see whether this could be something that I could do or not. Because it doesn't seem to be working out right now. But I haven't given it a try. This is just like the first time I've tried it. So, and swiping might not be my thing. Um, everything is not for everyone, but it doesn't stop you from trying to do it and trying to learn. Let's give this a go. And not even as good as the other one so <laughs> at least this one has a little bit of cells popping up you can see the other colors that's in there with this one all you see is the black
and you're not supposed to have to burn the paint to see the uh, color. So I guess that's a fail because I can smell that paint a little bit. And those cells are just not popping up. And I'm a little impatient too. And that's a part of the problem. And I probably need to wait to see what it's gonna do. Sometimes cells pop up later down the line. Looks like I see some popping going on. Give it a minute. Torch it a little bit more. Now, it seems like on my uh on my split the color split I tried to do look like it did more of a, a split action with the <laughs> without me trying to do a split than this right here. I'll show you what I'm talking about. So with this I just put the cell activator on top and just blew it. You see there at the top, see how much cell action that is and it kind of looks like a swipe but I just did that with blowing it out with the hair dryer and let me show you the other one it was just a spearmint trying to do a color split which I will go back to to try a color split because it didn't come out the way I wanted it to and this is the other one see how it looks like a swipe at the top it reminds me of a swipe <clears throat> but this definitely did not work. It did not come out right. So the paints do need to be thicker, but I don't think it needs to be too much paint. So if that's something that I'm interested in, I'll just have to play with that a little bit more to find out. And I have to see whether this does anything else, which I don't think it will. But I'll bring you down to see the first one that I did. I want to try it again um, to see because I think I put less paint on there than the first time. Well, actually the second time, this was the first time, which is a hot mess. And I tried to move it around to see whether it would do anything. It just turned into a freaking blob. But let me show you this one because it does have some sales up at the top. And that comes from me repeatedly going back over it. You know what? Let's go back over this. Let's, let's just go back over it for the sake of doing it. Glad I have my apron because I am just putting this paint all over it. See, I can see what's under there better now. But I'm expecting it to just pop up because I'm putting a cell activator on there. You know, I'm not expecting to have to go back over it with the uh, torch for the cells to pop up. I'm expecting for the cells to just pop up, you know, after I put the cell activator on there, but it didn't happen. And I don't know if it's too much paint because when I hit that part that had more paint on it, more cells came up. So maybe it's not too much paint. Maybe I'm just not doing it right. Maybe that's the answer. So let me bring you down so you can see it. 
that's the very first one that I did without even trying to change the consistency of the paint. You can see there, it's just like a blob. This is the second one that I did. Well, I think came out the best out of all of them. I just kept going back over it. This is the last one, which if you can see that part right there, it had more paint there. And when the torch hit it, it popped up with all those cells. So the fact that I said that it needed less paint may be true, but not as less paint as I'm thinking. Because as you can see, there is the most cells where I had a lot of paint at. So I think I'm just not doing it right and I need practice. And that's what it is. So it does not hurt to practice. That's how we learn. We fail and then we learn. So if this is something that I decide to give a go, I will practice more at it. And I will have to let you see my fails because this is a fail. But I did give it a try. So you guys, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you have not subscribed to my channel already, make sure that you subscribe to my channel. And I will put everything in the description of the video below the video. You can click on that little arrow and it takes you down to the description under the video. See you till next time, you guys.